as you know, I own thousands of human beings. <laughs> and here is the centerpiece of my human collection, Dr. Fay! for creating the Dr. Phil Show. For without it, I would truly be somewhere in Texas, sitting in a trailer, drinking excessively, and touching my private parts while watching Mexican soap operas. You know, recently a tornado touched down in Weed Hole, Oklahoma, and it was devastating. Wow. Wow. And my first guest is a man who lost everything. So please welcome guest. <laughs> Now, guest, <laughs> you lost everything in a tornado. That's right, Oprah. I lost my home, everything. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Uh, Oprah, may I speak? Uh, uh, make it quick. <laughs> Absolutely, Oprah. And thank you, Oprah. <laughs> now, son, it's important for you to know that after a natural disaster, people can rebuild. They can take the shattered remnants of their lives and they can put them back together. But you live in that crap sack, Oklahoma, so I don't know what the point is. Good luck. Good luck. Philip, you are so observant. Wow. Wow. I mean, honestly, isn't he the best fake therapist you've ever seen on television? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You know what, guest? My heart really goes out to you. So I'm going to give you the Oprah Hawkeye! Oh. <laughs> In order to rebuild your home, you're going to need an architect, <laughs> contractors, <laughs> a design team from Home Depot, <laughs> and lots, and lots. Of cash. <laughs> so good luck with that. But what I'm going to get you is a ladies' cashmere scarf from Burberry. <laughs> from my favorite things collection in this month's All Magazine. And what I'd like to give you, son, is a bottle of Dr. Phil's amazing fat cutter and stain remover. <laughs> That's for you. There you go. I need a home! <laughs> Not a scarf, you dumb bitch! <laughs> Philip, go to your cage. <laughs> Absolutely, Oprah. <laughs> How dare you question Oprah's list of favorite things? You have not only sealed your fate, but that of the entire studio audience. Hotel. Bow down to Oprah, infidels. 